What's up everybody? Welcome back to more PlayStation 5 news and restock videos. Uh, I just wanted to let you guys know that uh, I think Best Buy did go live yesterday. I kind of missed out on that. If you guys got one uh, from Best Buy yesterday, let me know in the comments below because I really want to see if anyone got the PlayStation 5. I know it did go live, but I think I was on it like the very last minute just to see where it said see details and then it was out of stock so if you guys got one just let me know I want to see that and then all right guys so here we go for Best Buy so they're gonna go live next week again it seems like their uh, their pattern is they're going live every every Friday so hopefully and I'm sure they're gonna go live this coming Friday so definitely check that out and also just uh, check out your like local Walmart and all that stuff because Walmart should have those wave things again and then when it goes it does go live see right here it will say the date and time so say for example if it were to go Monday it would say March 8 2021 and then it show the time like 3 p.m. or and then they do like four different waves so what uh, what I learned like how to like how to beat that where it says uh, like when there's like two minutes or three minutes left just uh, refresh it once and uh, I kind of found, uh, found it easier on the on the phone like the app the Walmart app just refresh it like two minutes before and then uh, go on it where it says still the time right there when it has the time just stay on it and out of nowhere it'll just pop up and just add it to your cart because that's that's how it worked for me when I did it with the Xbox because it gave you like four different wave options so one wave I was like uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna refresh it that minute and see if it happens. So I refresh it. I refreshed it right when it happened. That didn't work out. And then the second time I did it, where uh, I left the page and came back, and that did not work. And then the third time, I just said uh, I'm just gonna refresh it like a few minutes before and just stay on it and see what happens. So I did that, and then it said add to car. I added it to the cart, and I bought it. Like they sent me the email saying you purchased this. And literally a minute later, it said, your order has been canceled. So I don't know why they canceled my order. That's why I, I kind of don't trust them after seeing that. So if that happened to you guys, I don't know. I, I even tried calling them and they all they said is, we're sorry. So definitely keep that in mind that something like that may happen. If it doesn't happen, great. But if it happens to you guys, I'm sorry. But that's what happened to me, so that's why I kind of don't trust the uh, Walmart online with the the Xbox and the PlayStation. And uh, for Target, usually uh, they went live that one time Sunday, so definitely check it tomorrow and see if it does go live. And hopefully you guys can secure one. And then uh, also see with GameStop, they haven't they haven't really told us anything. If they did, if you guys are signed up to their notifications and stuff, you'll get an email saying when they'll go live. But they don't actually give you a time, they just give you the date. And then the day of, they'll tell you maybe like 10 minutes before or 30 minutes before saying we'll have a few uh, PlayStation and Xbox Series uh, X bundles so that you guys can get one. So, but GameStop hasn't said anything yet. So, right now just stick with... Uh, uh, Best Buy and Walmart and see hopefully they will go live soon and All right guys, that's the that's the update. I have for you guys next week uh, Best Buy will be going to going live again, and hopefully Walmart does go live too and uh, Please subscribe to my channel. We are giving a PlayStation 5 away once we reach our subscribers All right guys till next time peace out